Hey guys, and so in the last video, I know you were just super thrilled and, and highly impressed with my singing skills when I sung about uh, about taking me out to the ball game uh, when it was when we were talking about baseball. So today I'm wearing my basketball cap, but we st we're still going to be talking about baseball. So when is an A not an A? Um, look at the word baseball. You have two A's there, and then yet the first one has a long diphthong type of sound to it. A, base, and then the other one is ball, baseball. So what do we learn? We learn that that in American English, the letters really don't mean anything. They, they, they can take on different sounds depending on where they are, the type of letters, uh, where they are in the word, the type of letters that, 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 that follow them and what have you. So we're going to be ta talking about these two sounds, the A sound and then the AW sound. And as you'll see, sometimes it doesn't even have the same letter, but yet it'll still make the same sound. So again, this is going to be part two of our baseball learning American English through baseball series. Okay, we'll talk to you later. I know, right? You, don't you just love American English? Many times it doesn't make any sense, and I'm really sorry about that, but hey, we're here to try to figure it out. So we have the basically two A's that don't sound like each other. And maybe in school you were taught, um, you know, one or two ways of doing it. But as you'll see here, that the different vowels will have different sounds to them. Uh, even the same vowel will have different sounds. So the bass part, the A sound that we're talking about in, in the first part of baseball, um, you'll see words that are very similar to that. So if you take a look here on the left side of your screen, you'll see hey, wait, great, and wait. All of them spelled differently, but they all have the same sound. And not one of them is a repeat of that singular A that we talked about in baseball. So in this sound, it has actually two sounds to it. And the, the letter A sound has two sounds to it. It's a A, E, A, E. So you want to make sure you complete that sound. So you can see this in words like, hey, wait a minute. Uh, you'll see those that sound in that 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 uh, those words or hey you want to go to the uh, to the movies tomorrow yeah great great you'll see that coming up so very important to learn now in baseball the other part of it is an aw sound think about it as if you you saw something so cute whether it's a puppy or a kitten or a little baby or you know uh, those cute songs that I, I, were, I was making for you and you just said, aww. So your, your, your bottom lip kind of goes in just a little bit. And we'll, we'll talk about this in a future video. But it should have this sound, an aww sound to it. Bass ball. Hey, call me later. Aww. Or that was awful. Or, hey, you know, all of your videos, Ron, are just awesome. So you want to have that kind of sound with it. So practice that for me. Ball, call, awful, and awesome. See, it, it shouldn't sound like that first A at all that we talked about. It should have an aw sound to it. And, and you'll see this needed in, in real life. And hand me that ball. Or uh, let me return your call all tomorrow, right? Or, hey, uh, we're going to get together tomorrow and we're going to hang out at, uh, at, uh, at Jimmy's house. Okay, awesome. Yeah, I'd love to do that. Awesome. So these are some of the words if you're going to be here in the United States or even sound like you have a good American accent and, and speaking ability. These are some of the things that you're going to want to pick up. So remember, two different sounds with the letter A. You have an A sound and an A sound. So practice these today. I'd love to hear from you um, and, and let me know what you think and uh, let me know and maybe 
record yourself and, and let me know what you come up with. Love to hear from you. So in a later video, we're actually going to talk about how to make these sounds. But for right now, practice them and see what you see uh, in, in real life uh, that you hear these sounds. Thanks.